I've been to Lisbon quite a few times now over the past few years and I just love 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 the history of Lisbon the beautiful old buildings and the delicious food that you can buy there as well so sit back and enjoy the sights of Lisbon enjoying looking at some of the wonderful sites of Lisbon I'll give you 15 fun facts about Lisbon things that you might not have known so fact number one did you know Lisbon is the oldest city in Western Europe Athens is older but Athens is not in Western Europe so that's a fun fact for you fact number two Lisbon was founded by the Phoenicians in 1200 BC so you can see it really is pretty old fun fact number three there aren't actually any official documents saying that Lisbon is the capital of Portugal we just know it as the capital of Portugal but there aren't actually any documents saying that fact number four the Raven is the symbol of Lisbon there's like a whole story about it which I'd need to do a little bit more research about it fact number five it is said that like Rome Lisbon is built on seven hills but when people have counted them they reckon it's actually eight hills so I don't know you have to decide what exactly is a hill I suppose fact number six the Santa in Gracia church took nearly 300 years to build because the architects kept dying unexpectedly and people believed that there was a curse on them Fact number seven, the Vasco da Gama uh, bridge, which I drove over this last trip, it only took 18 months to build, but they did have 3,300 workers building it. This bridge is 17 kilometers long, and it's one of the longest bridges in Europe, and it cost one million, uh, one billion, oh, sorry, not million, one billion dollars. US dollars to build. Fact number eight the football club Benfica has over 14 million fans, and some people say it has one of the largest fan clubs in the world. Fact number nine the city actually commissioned street artists to brighten up the city with graffiti so in Lisbon you're not going to get fined for your street art so Banksy wherever you are you welcome in Lisbon obviously fact number 10 in 1755 Lisbon was hit by a magnitude 9 earthquake which destroyed a large part of the city and killed a hell of a lot of people back number 11 under the streets of Lisbon they discovered a 2,000 year old Roman city and this was the only reason why they discovered it was because I suppose they found evidence of it after the 1755 earthquake Number 12 
Lisbon wasn't always the capital of Portugal. So even though, as I told you earlier, there's no actual documentation saying it's the capital, there were other cities which were documented as being the capital of Portugal before Lisbon became the capital. Unofficial capital? I don't know. Would we say unofficial? Not too sure. Fact number 13. Although the Belem Tower was built as a military fortification between 1514 and 1520 to guard the entrance to Lisbon's harbour, it was also used as a prison in the 1800s. Now this tower is quite magnificent, I have to say. And I can just imagine like those ancient well, they're not that ancient, I suppose, in the 1500s. Those explorers like the Polymutias, Vasco da Gama, some of the others, that would be the last thing that they would see before they would leave the harbour on their trip. So that would be quite amazing. Fact number 14. Lisbon is home to both the oldest bookstore in the world and also the smallest bookstore in the world. So, there you go. And fact number 15. My favorite thing ever. The Pistea Donata. Now, even though Pistea Donata are made all over Portugal, and in fact, you can buy it all over the world. I know I've bought Pistea Donata in Cape Town as well, there are actually only three people in Lisbon who actually know the original recipe and they say that they are not allowed to travel in the same mode of transport in case there's an accident because the recipe is not written down, it's been passed on verbally all these years. So I'd love to get the actual real recipe, but I don't think they'll give it to me. So I hope you've enjoyed these 15 fun facts and sit back and enjoy some of the other sites of Lisbon. And definitely, definitely include it on a trip to Europe. I mean... You know, if you are going to Portugal, to the Algarve, include a few days in Lisbon as well. There's lots to see and do over there.
have enjoyed this quick jaunt around Lisbon and the 15 fun facts that I gave you. I'd appreciate it if you could like and subscribe to my channel. I post videos each week, either videos on my travels, recipe videos, or my journey to buying a farm in Portugal. So I have a whole series on Portugal as well. So help an old lady to grow her YouTube channel, subscribe, and I'll see you on my next adventure. Keep safe.